Are you ready for the best fame in NBA 2K21? <laughs> Alright you guys, so on a serious note, I really want to help you guys out financially. If you don't know like what I'm about, I'm a businessman. Doing pretty well for myself at the age of 23. So long story short, I got into stocks, right? I was too lazy though, I'm a lazy kid, to learn everything, you know, I'm very impatient. So I used my connections, found some people, and I found three stock experts that told me they will give me their picks as long as I pay them, up front. I said, okay, that's a no-brainer. I paid them, now I'm doing very good in stocks. So I thought to myself, I want to help out a lot more people, okay? So I created a group with these three same experts, okay, three same experts that helped me make good money, and the group is called Poseidon Stocks. It's $25 a month. Now listen, I know that turns you off, but this 25 bucks will literally change your life, you know, unless you're just, you don't listen to what they have to say. You know, the link will be in the description. The reason why I'm even charging because I have to pay them a lot of money. Eventually, I will lower the price, even though I hope $25 is affordable. Uh, link in description, you can ask the page questions, whatever. Hope you join, and without further ado, let's get into this fadeaway. Okay? Let's get it. What's going on, YouTube? It's the Go White Boy of 2K. It is Young Dirk. I am showing you guys the best fadeaway slash dribble pull-up in NBA 2K21. I'm going to make this video short and sweet for you guys, not like these other YouTubers that try to extend an easy three-minute video to 47.5 minutes. So if you could hit the like button for me, I would highly appreciate that, okay, honey pie? And what I also want you to do is, if you aren't entertained or your game is not better by watching my other videos, I will give you a kiss. So I recommend going and checking out my other videos. You will not regret it. I can promise you that, okay, cutie patootie? Listen to what I have to say. I'm here to help you guys out. I'm a good player. I'm gonna give you the fade. Do not worry. Just let me explain a few things. These clips are on my play shot with an 88 open shot mid. I have on difficult shots and corner specialist on Hall of Fame, which are the two badges you want to have when you're shooting fades. If you're a fade only fade heavy player, put on difficult shots and corner specialists on gold or hall of fame. Those are a great badge stack to use. I have a video on the best shooting badges to use overall on my channel. Go check that out. All right. So I'm about to give you guys the fade, but in case you need some like credibility or whatever to make sure I'm good, go watch me on Twitch, you know, or just try out the fade and you'll see that I'm not lying to you. My Twitch is in the description. I stream daily. So the fade is Athletic 2. You want Athletic 2 because there is that one animation right there that you just create so much space out of. You, with the fades this year, there's like weird animations you can get. It's almost random, but in the corners, I've noticed you get that great leaning fade that creates a ton, a ton of space. And that is what you want when you are trying to shoot these fades. If you can't use this one, put on Curry, but I really recommend using Athletic 2. It creates the most space. Now listen, this is very important. This also has to do with your jump shot. A lot of people don't know that. If you don't have on a high green percentage jump shot, you will miss fades. You wanna have a good jump shot. I'm gonna leave my jump shot video in the description for you guys. So go check that out. Now when you're shooting these fades, I want you to look at your hands when you are timing your release. I don't want you, you to use the shot meter. Take it off the shot meter and look at your hands to time the shot. I actually look at my feet because on certain animations when the feet are at a certain point, you can somehow time it. I don't know how, but I'm just a little weird. So look at the hands. And the last thing is, don't shoot a fade if someone is in front of you or on the side of you. Make sure they are trailing you. Okay, you guys? That is the video I told you I would make it short and sweet. Subscribe. You won't regret it. Have a good day. Go out. <laughs>